Hey guys, I'm back. I am now, I've washed and I'm going to show you guys how I do a wash and go, which I do not think this should be called a wash and go because you definitely don't wash and go. It's more like a um, wash and wear. It's how you wear your hair right after you wash it. Okay, so first I'm going to let you guys know what I did. My scalp, oh god, it was feeling so dirty and i'm on my second week of the curly girl method for those of you who don't know what it is is basically you use conditioner only to wash your hair no shampoo um i've tried it before before the whole accident And I stopped, and so I figured I'm going to give it a go for this summer. Um, so first off, what I did, I have Jamaican black castor oil in here. And I just parted my hair almost like how I did my oil treatment. Um, and I put this in there. Because why Jamaican black castor oil is oil? Why would you oil your hair to make it feel cleaner? Um... They say that castor oil has the astringent products or properties, so I decided to go ahead and give it a try. Then I used uh, my regular water bottle and squirted water right directly on top of it and just kind of just almost scrubbed my hair with the pads of my fingertips. Um, so that's what I did and I twisted my hair, jumped in the shower. Next, second, um, this is As I Am coconut um co-wash i don't have the bottle right here with me now but i basically scooped it out and put it in here so that it was easier in the jar it's hard it's messy you get water in it, it it's a hot mess um but this helps get down in my parts and then really 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 scrub it after i finished that i just bought this guy See that guy? This is Tea Tree Triple Treat. I used this um, and it gave me a more like tingling sensation. I got this from TJ Maxx for $12.99. Um, but they always have a lot of Giovanni products on sale. So I use this. I also have some of this silk. I didn't use that this time though. I used this because I wanted that, that tingling feeling. So did a good job. Alright, so on to how I do this wash and wear deal. First of all, I use this. That is your direct leave-in by Giovanni. It's a leave-in conditioner. I do that first. Then I apply my um, Trader Joe's coconut oil, regular organic coconut oil. And then I use the um, olive oil eco styler gel on top of it. So, I'm going to get right into it and let you guys see. Um, of course, I started with my famous uh, part straight down the middle. And my, right now, my hair is clipped away from when I washed it. Um, so, it's still soaking wet. You can see all the water glistening on my body. Um, but I don't want to dry it. Drying it like will make it more frizzy. So, don't do that. So, I'm going to section a piece. Twist the rest up, take some leave in, it's almost gone. <clears throat> I use a generous amount um, because I finger detangle with it. So as I put this in here and it's lots of slip, I go ahead and I finger detangle it. And I'm just going like this. So I can go all the way through. After that's in there, I go ahead and take some coconut oil, about that much. Put it on here. Make sure it's on my ends and I still continue to detangle 
if I feel a little bit of tangles or whatever. Now, I'm ready to apply my gel. When applying the gel, um, I don't finger detangle. I just smooth that. So I take, I don't know if you can tell how much that is, but pretty much generous. Now, this is just going to be like for the roots of my hair. So, um, it's almost like I'm painting or giving myself a relaxer right there. And I just want to make sure that I don't have any frizz area there. So I make sure that, that all of that area is laying flat and nothing is sticking up. Then I grab about the same amount more and now I'm going to work it down into the hair. And working each piece that looks like it needs to be sectioned off, sectioned off. Now, take it all the way down to the ends. You can see how my hair is like getting really straight because it's too much. I just kind of wiggle it like that and I have a curl. Um. Now, keep in mind, my hair is not super curly as it used to be because of the whole situation of um, a hairdresser's mad attack. But, um, here's what you see when it's done. So, this section is finished, and then I just move to the next, the next section. Okay, so I'm finished. Um, this is the finished look. This side is, of course, dry now. Well, a little bit because this was the first side. And this side is not dry yet. Um, um, that's it. I'm going to try to see if I can get some um, close-up images for you guys. And I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye.